ever used one of these Ecolution micro pop microwave popcorn popper? The other day, me and Eric were watching a movie and we pulled out a regular thing, a bagged uh, microwave popcorn. And I thought, I need a new solution because I don't want to eat this because there's a lot of issues with them, right? So I wanted to get one of these to see how it uh, works. This one is a Paris Hilton branded one because I like the pink, but they make these in all kinds of different colors. So we're going to try this out today. Welcome to the Amy Learns to Cook Kitchen. So I've seen these things for years and I wanted to try them out and I just saw this pink one and I was like, I want to try this because it's pink. <laughs> So this one is branded Paris Hilton. It's the Eco, Eco, Eco Lotion, Eco Lotion uh, Micro Pop. And um, they make these in all different colors. This one you can get at Walmart, but I'll put links down in the description so you can look at all the colors they make. So there was this thing going around recently about microwave popcorn being really bad for you because of the way they made the bag. So a lot of things came out with these things. I love the color on this one. Look at this. It is the popcorn. Um, so how these things work is we're going to put the popcorn in here. We're going to put the butter on this thing and we're going to microwave it, right? So I need to wash this out. We have some Orville Redenbacher's original. And we're going to see how these things can do. Have you guys used one of these before? If you have, put a comment down and let me know how you like it. Um, this is the first time I've ever used this. This has been out for years. It's like about time that Amy got around to trying one of these out. So let me go wash this up. Okay, so I have this all washed up. Eric washed it for me. Thank you. Sure. Uh, okay, so their thing is if you want half of a bucket of popcorn you're going to put one of these in or if you want a full bucket of popcorn you're going to put two so we have orville here and we're going to one two and we're going to put some butter up here in this. I don't know how much butter you put in here. So there you go. So let's go over to the microwave. So we're going to go ahead and put our little popcorn popper in here. So we're going to hit cook time. I'm going to go three minutes and we're going to listen for the pop. So it's barely starting to pop. So I'm going to add another 30 seconds on there. I think I'm going to add another 30. Another 30. It smells like popcorn. Another 30. It's slow down enough. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to take it out of there cuz it was starting to slow down. Okay, so it took a little bit longer. Oh, some of the kernels are a little burned. Well, cuz they're burned. If that's what that's strike one. Well, uncooked kernels versus burning them, right? It's a trade-off. They're burned. How much butter did you get in there? Does it taste wonderfully buttery? No. So you probably needed more butter. Let's try this again. So this time we're only going to do a one batch. Because, I don't know, it seemed like it took so long for them to start popping. And then when they did... Some of them popped early on, and then the other ones didn't pop. And so I think those ones got burned waiting on the other ones. So we're just going to go a single here. A big hunk of butter. There was hardly no butter flavor in all that popcorn. Mm -hmm. Let's go over to the microwave. Okay, in the microwave. I'm just going to put four minutes, and we'll see what happens. 
we're approaching two minutes and it hasn't stopped par popping yet. This was a problem I had before. It didn't start popping until like the two and a half minute mark. And at three minutes, it had just started going and I kept having to add 30 seconds. Now we're in the same situation. We're creeping up on 30, three minutes and it hasn't started popping yet. Well, you're at two and a half minutes right now. Here we go. Okay. One. So this is about the time where they said three minutes, but it just started popping. I can't take it out yet. Because most of them won't be popped. So we're creeping up at three and a half, and it's still actively popping. I'm taking it out at four minutes regardless. Because it's going to burn. So it's coming out. Okay, let's see what we have here. So it's much better. A lot of uncooked. A lot of uncooked. Uh, but you didn't burn it. Well, I have a little char left over from the last time, so. But it is better. I don't think I would do a double batch. No. Let's see if there's any butter in there. Yeah. So some reason it gets a little bit of soot in there. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Well, it could be your burnt butter. It could be. It's tasty. I think it's a little trial and error. How's it taste? It's good. It's not burnt. I had quite a few um pot, but it was it was definitely better. So you have to take it out way before it starts slowing. It depends on your microwave. Your microwave power. Hmm. Okay. So what do I give this? I gave it a B minus. It's a trade-off. If it's healthier than the alternative... It could an A, then. But it's not as convenient or tasty, either, is it? It's pretty tasty. It is tasty? I'll give it a B. So this is the Popcorn Michael Pop by e Collusion. Oh. Link will be in the description. It's not perfect. It's going to take a little adjusting for your microwave. But once you get it, once you dial it in, I think it will be good. I ran another batch at four minutes. Yes, the same half. Time. It's the same time. I tried to do three and a half, but it wasn't. How's the unburnt kernels in there? Or uncooked? A little bit less? Yeah, okay. there was less. It could be because the thing's hot. Yeah. Maybe if you can preheat the thing first and then pop it, maybe. It was tasty. Because our microwave warmed up a bit. That's what the fan's on. Yeah, the fan's on the microwave. Um, you just have to play with a couple batches, depending on your microwave. Because all different microwaves have different sizes, different wattages. This is pretty good. So I think we dial it in four, four minutes, minutes four hours. half a batch. Maybe when they were saying two and a half to three, are they referring to a half a batch and six for a full? I don't know. Could it be, doesn't say that. Could be, but by then with ours, we burned it. We burned it. We burned it up. Four and a half or so. Yeah, over four times. Mm. I also noticed that like the pat and half of butter on the half, Gave me butter flavor. It's not enough really butter to do a whole. So I would just do a half on this. Just do a couple of half batches yeah. as needed. Let's enjoy.
enjoy it. 